I hope everyone's having a great time joining with us on our summer farewell show this week in the Tampa Bay area. Ball, who do we have next? Race number four will feature Kyle Richman and the Bobby Maid of Bobby K against the 2017 Tag Team Champions, Albion Jr. and Chris Finacos. Yes, sir, this will be a rematch of last season's third place playoff. Let's see who's going to come on top this time around. Good to the next two teams on Christmas victory, and let's rock this place! Alright, so the last time they battled was in week three. And of course, out here in junior, and Christmas Knuckles won the battle that day. Let's see who will come on top in round two of this saga. Right now, in the fourth channel, I'm going to check the palm tree, so bring down that coconut chip food. <coughs> and number eight is going to So he will be right behind the crowd for a moment. <coughs> right now, Bobby K and Chris Monagos are going to be bounding frontly up in front. And it looks like they're both heading for the water, trying to maintain the ground. Out here, you decided to join along with these two chow. As the first superstar against Beepus is number eight, who desperately needs to catch up every now and then. And look at that. He is expected to have the lead over the four silver chow because one silver chow square rest and number one is Parsec one more. And right now, Kyle Richman is rapidly approaching the water, making it to the other side of the water. As BUS number two in space, we may buy number seven, who's trying to catch up with number eight for the lead on the four silver chow. And right now, it is Chris Winarcos and Amir Jr., who's taking first and second respectively, following in the cross fed by the Bobby Mayor, Bobby K. As the next BUS we may buy, number one, and he will lead number two in us. And Chris Finock goes to the squad rest. So he will drop down the third place on the competition. That means Alvin here Jr. will have to battle with Chris Finock goes for the lead up in the front. We passed a one minute mark in this race. The fourth free channel heading towards the south line portion of course. Chris Finock goes trying to make a comeback here after taking a nap. As we head back into number one. And now he takes the lead over the fourth free channel away from number eight. <coughs> Meanwhile, number two is getting left behind, and so is number seven. Which one of them will get the next command speed bonus? Which one of us is going to need help to stay alive? It's going to be number two who gets it, but I think he needs a lot more help than that to stay again. Will we get it? We'll find out soon enough. And back with fun, Chris without goals, Bobby K, and I'm here Jr. are climbing up the top of the wall. Who will win this one? We'll find out soon enough. Next because belongs to number one. That makes a spurt speed bonus to the base. <coughs> <clears throat> and right now, number two is getting left behind still along with number seven. And who got the next one? It is the son on the to drive. Out here in Junior, who is catching up to Bobby K for second place. Chris Monaco's in the lead, and I do believe he's going to have a little bit of room to rumble ahead of the Bobby Man and the Bobby K. Yep, number eight when the next command is being That makes it. Second speed bus to the base. Trying to regain control on the lead on the four switch out. <clears throat> and Chris Monaco has his face all wrapped up. Chris Monaco's leads Avenue Jr. for the mid -way. That's great, bye bye. Avenue Jr. in second place. And but the bottom of the bottom day will come in third place. And the last three months up in this race, probably we may buy Kyle Richman. A little disappointed with fourth place. Number one can just forget about this race all the way in the back. <clears throat> Alright, so Avenue Jr. and Chris Monaco's won the job again. That's right, but what about the rest of the season? We'll soon know. Coming up, we got more action for you, but first have a look at this.